As you may already know, trading arbitrage is a strategy used to take advantage of price differences across different markets. Today, we're going to install one of the best tool in the world for arbitrage trading, Western Pips Private 7. After purchasing the product, you will receive an installation file along with your credentials. Let's go ahead and extract the file, and we'll begin the installation process. The installer file can usually be found in your downloads folder, or it might be on your desktop. Before installing the software, it may prompt you to update .NET. This update is necessary as it ensures that all .NET-based applications function correctly on your system. Once the update is complete, we can go ahead and run the Western Pips Private 7 installer. Simply click Install. Next, enter your user credentials and click Login to access the dashboard. On the left side, you'll see the menu with various strategies and contract connections. At the top, we have additional menu options that we'll explore step by step. For example, you'll find the one leg section here. We also have other options like fast, slow one, and slow two. But don't worry because we'll dive deeper into these features in future videos. On the right side, you have more options for configuring the platform. Click More to see a menu with all available strategies. For instance, we can choose Multi-Leg here, and at the bottom of the screen, you'll see the details. Let's click More again to explore additional strategies. Now let's look at the Two-Leg Simple Hedge strategy. Let's move on to another strategy, One-Leg Multi, which brings us to a different configuration menu compared to others. We'll go into detail on this one in future videos. Clicking More again brings us to another strategy. Here you'll notice a similar configuration to the others. It's important to note that many strategies share the same settings. The remote option is meant for a completely different purpose. Lastly, we have the back testing menu, which will be the focus of an upcoming video. I hope you found it helpful and I'll see you in the next video.